Hey guys, Marshall from Going Gear, SHOT Show 2014 in Las Vegas. We are here with Kevin from Leatherman, and he's going to show us Lead Lenser's new upgraded flashlights and all their new models. So what do we have first? Well, uh, first we've basically upgraded our entire line of products. New optics, uh, new finishes, new switches, new buttons. Uh, we really enhanced the performance level. For instance, our best seller typically is our P7 flashlight. It's a four AAA driven model, and uh, we were at about 175 lumens before, and we're at 320 lumens now. Uh, basically the same retail price too, $70 wow. okay. retail, yeah. And you said a different finish. What kind of finish are you guys using now? Well, it's a, it's a little bit more matte finish. Okay. Um, it actually doesn't is slippery in the hands, so a uh, little bit better ergonomics and control as you handle the flashlight. And you said optics. I noticed the optics, you know, when it was uh, on the diffused out beam, it did look a little bit better. What did you guys do different? Uh, a couple things. We redesigned our optic to uh, basically harmonize with the new LED that we're using from Cree. So, okay. Yeah, it's, it's precision geometry that gives you a nice even flood beam uh, on the flood mode, but then tightens down to a tight spot that'll cast out a, a long distance. Sure, okay. So that's across the entire line. So across the entire line, our P-series, T-series, and our headlamp models, H-series. So literally every single flashlight? Not every single flashlight, most of them, but most, most of them, okay. absolutely. Okay. Including our... Uh, X21 went from about 1,200 up to uh, 3,000 lumens. Pretty bright, That's huh? That's pretty bright. So what's the throw on that guy now? What kind of distance can you get out of it? Uh, let's see here, 700 meters. That's impressive. Yeah. That's nice for a light that size. Yeah. So 3,000 lumens, 700 meters, and you guys are using ANSI FL1, so that's directly comparable to all the other guys, right? Absolutely. E excellent, excellent. So what do you have this new? Well, on the new side, we've got uh, the M3R, you notice when we put an R on the, on the suffix of our product, that means it's rechargeable. So this is actually using a uh, AAA sized lithium ion battery and we're pumping out 220 lumens in a very, very small package. That's a lot for a light that size. Absolutely. Most people don't make them compatible with the, with the lithium ion batteries and lights that size because they get hot so fast. Are you they, guys taking care of all of that and everything? They do. Uh, this is, I believe, about a 450 milliamp battery so we're not using a 900 that can get you into trouble with the quick discharge rates sure um, what's also great too is it'll accept a standard AAA alkaline battery as well any idea what the output is with one of those 80 lumens or so no it's it's a little bit better than that it's somewhere in the 120 150 range okay can you show us the charger on that because I know people are gonna ask me about it sure absolutely you know popping open the light here you can see it's the lithium-ion AAA cell Simply charges in this unit here with the USB interface. Uh, does it come with a wall adapter or you just use your standard cell phone that everybody has 20 of lying around? That's right, use, okay. use your phone charger. Okay. So what you got this next? Uh, and then next we have our P7QC, which stands for the quad color. Okay. So you've got 220 lumens of white light but then switching the dial gives you blue, green, and red. Cool. Yeah. Can I see that? Yeah. So you just twist the uh, twist the head, twist the bezel. We're actually using a a single LED with four different dyes. Is it the Cree XML, the color one? Correct. Yeah. Nice. I've seen some other flashlights like this, but they kind of get distorted, funky beams. This one, you guys actually have the optic worked out to where. Uh, it still presents like a nice, smooth, clean, even beam. Absolutely. Any focus on this? No focusing no focus. ability. Uh, just a nice, floody light on that. Yeah, the optic properties of that uh, four-color dye just don't really present themselves for sure for focusing capability. So, uh, are the couple different outputs and the flashing mode on on all the colors? Correct. Okay. So yeah, if you switch switch that light. It'll stay in that mode. Oh, nice. Depending on what color you're in. And what's the model name again? This is the P7QC or quad color. P7QC, all right. Okay, what's next? Uh, that's that's it. So those are the new models. Those are the new models. Those are and pretty again, cool. uh, upgraded models and 
Yeah, we're, we're really excited about it and think that uh, it really puts us ahead of the competition. What's, what's that guy that you just had in your hand? <laughs> well, this is one of our, our most popular items. Items. This is our P5R. Okay. And we got the upgrades on this one too, so we added dot two, so it's a P5R dot two actually. Okay. So we went from about 200 lumens up to 270. So it's kind of a new item. Kind of a new item, but our uh, I like charging, charging interface system. is that's really nice. easy to use. So Mount that's this on your wall. So that's uh, magnetic. It'll attach no matter what position or orientation or anything like Absolutely. that? You don't have to line up the contacts and snap it into yeah. a cradle, just pop it in. And you This stays on your, mall, your wall and then travel. Nice. USB. So same USB uh, charging interface. Absolutely. Great. Well, cool, man. We appreciate it. Thanks yeah, for thanks uh, taking lot. the time.